read it? Okay. okay. Uh, who needs more time to look at it? Okay. <clears throat> Logos and the pathologos, right? Mm-hmm. Um, is, is this connected? With no, this, this is uh, this happened four, five, eighteen, and the stream happened uh, last week. direction that would take the dream. I was just looking at this. Uh, okay. <coughs> Me too, I was looking at this. I didn't realize that was right. kind of the dream. Right. Right. How would you perceive it? Well, this is how I perceive it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I've had a, a thought on my mind that I wanted to know my own personal logos. Um, that I didn't want to be stuck in my pathologos. Mm-hmm. And here it is, the two and the five, the logos and the pathologos. Mm-hmm. And so, therefore, since I have this on my mind, it, it's bringing in the unity, it seems mm-hmm. like, to the lo- logos and the pathologos. And... Um, <clears throat> it's like the yin and the yang, the two sides of a person. Um, and how if you unify them, they, they become equal. And then they have power. And you can use them both to bring about unity and power. Um, How can you use that to understand the dream? Because this is what's been on my mind. Um, What do you mean? Can you explain more what you mean by that? Just relate it now to the dream, what you just said. Because the 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 logos is in the in the second hypothesis of Parmenides, mm-hmm. and the pathologos is in the fifth um, hypothesis of the Parmenides. The ten, like my brother said, it could be divided by one, and then therefore everything can be divided by one. If one was to look at this, they would see no difference as they all look the same with no difference. They all just look like fish, people. What was it like in the dream at that moment, seeing that? Okay, there you are. At that moment, what was that like? I saw unity. I saw unity and oneness. Um, I saw people, humans. Um, Human looking people. Um, 
Sure. There was no difference. Okay. If one was to look at this, mm-hmm. that's a contrast. Mm-hmm. Yes. Because some may not look at it. <laughs> right? <laughs> uh, yes. And if they don't look at it but that way, then they don't see it. They don't see it. They don't see the unity or the oneness. <laughs> and who's doing the singing in the dream? Me. You. I'm doing the singing. Right. And that singing is a kind of unity and wonder, is it not? Yeah, I'm wondering, I wonder at the unity. I wonder at it. Good morning. To me, it's beautiful. It's, um... Seeing that is beautiful, mm -hmm. right? Yes, when I looked at what I was looking at, it was beautiful. Like the fish and how they were living, the fish people, and how they were living, and their, their beautiful colors, and their beautiful city, and, um... But unless they see it your way, go ahead. They don't see the beauty. They don't see the beauty. Alrighty then. Uh, what does it do for you to see that? Um, right now? It makes me emotional. Yeah. And what way? Come on. Um, I want to cry for them. Yeah, more. Um, my heart goes out to them. Right. Yeah. Um, I want to show them the beauty. Yeah. It's so simple to see. But finish it. They're blind. But they're, they're blind. They're blind almost. They can see, but they're blind. Yeah, well, that's, you know, that's that human condition because people are awake. They think they understand. <laughs> <sighs> I'm frust that frustrates me. <laughs> <laughs> right? Uh-huh. So, uh, see, I want to show them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know how. That's right. I don't know how. Mm -hmm. I've tried several different ways. Won't work. And it doesn't work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? Good question. I wish I knew. <laughs> they have to see it themselves. They have to discover it themselves. You may be able to provoke them, but you can't. Show them the beauty. See what you're at. See what you're literally wanting to do. Mm-hmm. Because mm -hmm. it's so simple. So simple. That's okay. But <laughs> you want to show them. Yeah, that it's simple. Yeah. That yeah. it's simple. Yeah, 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 yeah. That it's simply obtained. What's the obtained? difference between that and uh, um, Um, brought to see. Yes, that would be even better. What's the difference? If they're brought to see, then then um, this stays and it doesn't. It becomes part of them. If you just show them, it it's like, yeah, yeah. So it's a flower. Who cares? Therefore. <laughs> Therefore, they need to be brought to see the flower in all its magnificence. Are these different strategies? Heck yes. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> yeah. 
So that's interesting. Isn't it? What does that do to you? It, midwife, I'm just hearing my midwife in my head. That a midwife would be able to do this. No, no, no. N- but not you, this. But see, but only if they are, only if they are interested in doing it. The people or the midwife or both? Both. <laughs> both takes yeah. two to tango. Yeah. Yes, the midwife would have to want to bring bring the person to see, and then the person would want to be brought to see. Right. It has to be a. And this? No. 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 Yeah, like I said, you could say, hey, look at that beautiful flower. So, mm. who cares? It's a flower. Yeah. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What does that do to your dream? Can you say more? It pushes it further. Oh, further. yes, 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 yes. Mm. Uh, which one carries a burden? I know that burden very well. It's time to do what with it? Let it go. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. I like it. Bless you again.
Okay, when you're ready, how about some suggestions? Say, as you look over the dream, um, <clears throat> can you pick out the theme that is introduced? Uh, what happens to it? Um, does it come back again? What happens to it? What point is being made? Good beginning. Come on. That's true. He gets sidetracked. Therefore, yeah, come on, come on, come on. Or what would you want to explore? Well, what happened? What happened? Why? Why did he get so sidetracked on these other little? Then those are all tangents. Yeah. Or sidetracked. Sidetracked. Yeah. yeah. Little obstacles. Yeah. Little other things that yeah. sidetracked him. Yeah. 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 What do you think, man? Right? Well, I. The first, uh, the first time I actually, I was hungry while I was flying and I wanted to get some food. Yeah. So, um, yeah, that was the reason. But I never ended up getting any food. It's a major step flying during the sea. It's a very interesting step. But uh, what do you say about that? Would you agree that's the major thing? The fine. Yeah. Yes. And it plays a subordinate role because it gets caught up on this and that. Yes. Yeah. How would, what question would you pose? You know, I don't... Uh, hmm. I'm kind of baffled by the other thing he mentioned, which is that he had a goal of getting some food because he was hungry. But in, the, in paragraph three, he, he doesn't get the food, and you, you look, it looks like there's a situation where it's dangerous. That you could ask, how successful is he in each of the tangents? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, what would you say? He's unsuccessful with any That's right. of them. That's right. Mm -hmm. Dream is telling him something, isn't it? Curious. Yes. See what they're saying? Not me. Yeah. <laughs> right? I can't be blamed. What do you think of that? I go along with it. I'm wondering if even the getting some food is a tangent. Yeah. Getting, getting the food is even a tangent. That's right. Go ahead. And I'd want to know more what it was like flying before that struck you. It's all then therefore in the first sentence, right? <laughs> right? Did you read it first? I was flying in some way and going off to this train. And we want to know what it was like. Right ho, right. <laughs> it was really amazing. <laughs> Amazing. <coughs> yes. More. Spectacular. More. It was... Uh, Boring. No, it was very fun and... Fun? More. Uh, exciting and... 
playful and beautiful. And uh, smooth. And smooth. Yes, 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 yes. Now notice the second sentence. As I was getting closer, I was looking at it and deciding where I'd like to enter. Yeah. Because I'd like to get some food. Yeah. Therefore, what did you go for? Looking for? Food. Food. Yeah. Yeah. That's because you were starving. Well, I wouldn't say starving, but I didn't need to eat. Well, so you're leaving the stage. That's true. <coughs> It wasn't really an emergency. No, no, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Therefore, come on. Therefore, I... Um, well, I could have stayed in that state longer. And, and you also have some people watching you. Are they watching you flying? Uh, no, it wasn't... Or the food episode? They were watching me... Um, a couple of people looked at me as I arrived. Oh, yeah. And you went through the door smoothly. Yeah, right? yeah. yeah they didn't see me outside. Okay, okay. Therefore, <coughs> are they admiring something great? Um, uh, yeah, look here. If they'd admire you yeah. for going through the door, what would happen if they saw this? Yeah, they would. Yeah. That would be really good. Yeah, yeah. How about the third paragraph? So the second one is an, a slight episode of life between people, and they again admire what you have done, right? Yeah. And a past performance, is that right? Yeah. That was something... Yeah. Different from the flying was yeah. something. So what happens in the third? What would you look at as a key point? Um, a key point. Oh. Well, I didn't... Um, when I saw the first guy cooking, I kept walking. So that, obviously, I wasn't that hungry. <laughs> That's just the. It, it ties in with the first paragraph, which yeah, is the two parts in the third paragraph, right? Yep. So, uh, how are, are they connected? The cart. The the cart and the. Uh, fixing the food. Well, yeah. There are there are these like. Cooking stations inside the carts. Okay, okay. So that it played a key role. Yeah. Uh, what's the issue for you in the dream at that point? I want to get some specific food. Uh, would you pick it up from? Um, and he's explaining that about uh, seven lines down. No. But that the first cart, all the way at the other end, will do that. <coughs> and he's explaining that. Finish it. He's explaining that I just need to get them to put in a pin. Thank you. What's that like? Hmm. I think it was interesting, but I don't... You're not doing it. You need someone else to do it. Uh, what? Is that right? 
What do you mean? No, well, that's what it says. I just wondered. I need to get them to put in a pen. That's Not, that. You don't see it as your job. Well, that's what he's telling me. I need to do to get the food, which to get, is, to get them to fix the car. Yeah, so that I can get the food. I don't. It's a bit weird how those things are even related. Yeah, that's okay. I don't it's know. A dream. But, yeah. 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 <laughs> um, but look here. Given that, mm -hmm. what is his conclusion about the need for the pen? Like uh, somehow it's necessary in order for me to get the dish that I want. I agree with you. <coughs> Go back to the question. What's his conclusion? That I need to get them to do that. He's telling you something. You're caught up in it. What is his view of the need for the pen? Even though he's urging you to get them to put in the pen. He thinks it's a necessary step. It's, it's, imp it's important. It's what? It's important. Uh, would you read the last uh, line of that? Uh, last two lines? Like, you just, uh, you just get a car to the station. And then they call you like, hey, we're still here. He says it hasn't happened. What hasn't happened? That somebody forgets to put in the pin. <coughs> It hasn't happened. What does that do to his story? Oh, yeah. Yeah, what does it do to his story? <laughs> it makes it unnecessary. Right, 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 right. <laughs> unnecessary, right? That's weird. Yeah, 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 yeah. Keeping that theme in mind, what do you think about the next one? contrast between you and her, right? Yeah. What is it between you and her? Well, the, 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 this is the similar theme that I see is that um, it looks dangerous to me, but then there she is just... What, does that have any effect on you? No. You still are concerned with the... Not really. Yeah. What does well, that mean? Well, I was... I was reasoning that, um, in the dream, I was reasoning that she was, she already had momentum, mm -hmm. so it was easier to be safe, uh, whereas I was trying to take off, it was different. That was my well, reason. Well, in that case, that could be a good conclusion. Yeah. Right? It all depends upon that one issue, doesn't it? So what is it like when you, I walk off? What's that like? It's, it's good. It's, I made a decision and I'm... That's the necessary thing to do. So it's like I walk off. What happens to your desire to fly when you walk off? Because um, it looks like, come on. Well, the plan was to keep looking for a place to fly. No, no. So I still have the desire. So I still have the desire, but I can't bring it together. Yeah. Even though, yeah, and you see someone who's got the momentum doing it very effectively. So you're still shopping. Yeah. Yeah, good, 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 good. Um, Five. The board. Right. 
Yeah, that really surprised me. <coughs> well, what's the point that's going on now? <coughs> well, the the boar, the statue itself is is like magnificent. It's an amazing statue. Yeah, right, right, right. But at the same time, it's um, it's kind of weird. It's a strange thing because it's. Yeah, five and six are connected. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, it's amazing, yet it's weird. Yeah. And um, I'm just, I'm astonished by the size of it. The size is it's giant. It's like from this wall to that wall. Yeah. Come on. Well, that that I kind of uh, forget about that because it's overshadowed by the the cruelty of the other. Mm -hmm. um, it's it's yeah. a it's a live boar just sure. Sure. stuck in sure. stuck in place. And it's. Hmm. Uh, read the last sentence, will you? As I'm about to turn the corner, I see that he got out and he's walking away. What's it like? It's good. It's. I'm. I'm happy that he got out. And he's walking. And away. he's. Right. Happily walking right. away. So. He's happy. And you still haven't found a place to take off. That's true. Yeah. Mm. <coughs> but you're caught up in some weird things that are truly amazing, sure. Yeah. The boar is an interesting image for me. Go ahead. Because it's um, it captures it captures the problem that we explored in my last dream, which is rushing into things. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And to me, when I think of a boar, that's what I think, a boar rushing kind of aimlessly yeah. through mm -hmm. the bushes. Mm -hmm. And um, um, I've been playing with the idea of the boar a lot, actually, for the past mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. couple of days. And... Um, it's like uh, the, the way that the, the boar is idolized in this paragraph um, is kind of like the way that my family idolizes that state of mind. Mm -hmm. yeah, pretty, in other words, same thing. So, so it's like... Um, come, on. It, come on, it's similar to... To... Um, like uh, like it's it's almost it's almost considered something good to rush into things you know it's like uh, <coughs> it's like the religion it's like the religion of the of the house yeah. okay. and the boar the is like the, the house symbolizes the boar symbolizes the religion of the house yeah exactly yeah, yeah. 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 Um, what's the significance there for of that? The, the interesting thing is, my dad used to tell me stories about how they went hunting for boars. Mm -hmm. They used to kill boars. And it's like this weird, like they're trying to kill mm -hmm. their mm -hmm. problem mm -hmm. <laughs> or yeah. something. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Cool. Uh, so... So I think that's also why I like that the boar is walking away because the boar escaped. escaped and walks away. Yep. No longer a threat. No longer a threat. 
no longer a threat. They walked away. You mean to me? Yeah. That's true. Is that what it says? Yeah, he walks in the other direction. In the other direction. <laughs> Put this, come on, go back. A boar rushing around, it's very much like my home life. It's like a religion at the house that the boar symbolizes. And what happens to the boar? It's free, it got free. Well, I, I uh, definitely feel like I'm becoming free of that mm. way of being. Right, you're getting free of the house and the boar. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm, and I'm, I'm walking away. Now maybe you can find a place to fly. Right, yeah. <laughs> Because that's where you want to be. So. But you're already there. You see, these are all these are these are things that have that have already accomplished the second one. The music scene. It's already happened. You're getting getting congratulations for something that's already done. It's not part of your present. Right. The pin is, appears to be unnecessary. So that whole involvement. Equally well, the hamburger or the right, and um, with her, look her. I walk off, but I still have the desire right. to soar, right? Hmm. And this is soaring. Hmm. Looks like you may have to uh, find a place to take off. <laughs> 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 you get back to the state, huh? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fun the last thing, by the way. Um, What did you notice about your relation with her? Even though it's just started, but <coughs> um. well, I didn't. Oh, I, I didn't. remember in the dream you said she was a cross-eyed, one-legged girl who used to ride on a bike. No, she was a beautiful girl that. Oh, oh, oh. I didn't pursue. Oh. <laughs> Did you have the desire? Yeah. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> and the girl could fly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, that was an opportunity to fly together. Yeah. Yeah. That would be nice. And you ducked it. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So therefore, see, um, in that scene, that's why it's so important that I walk off. What state of mind is that? Remember, we said, well, you still have the feeling, you still have the desire, right? But there's two, two aspects to the desire. One is for her, yeah. and the other is for the state. Yeah, so wow. it's so that's uh, that's like um, that's probably the lowest point in Good. the in the dream. Yeah, well, this is a downer. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Failure. Yeah. Even though it was a great opportunity. Right. Hmm. But still have the desire, right? It's still strong. You've gotten free of the, the boar and what it represents. Yeah. So what's the dream telling you?
Well, uh, yeah, I need to find a place to take off. To take off. <laughs> I like that. Okay. <laughs> and it's it's confirming it's confirming. Um, yeah. My getting out of the. That maker. That religion. Yeah, that religion. Getting out of that family religion. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, God may be dead, but he lives in the household. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's take a break for a few minutes, and then we're going to start this. Yeah. Pleasure. Thank you for coming. Yeah. This is a... good. Oh, yeah. Good, good. Good. Yeah, sure, sure. Yes, sure. Okay, after the break. For you, so we're going to do something different. So, please pull up the table. Oh, you guys explored together? Yeah, he did it first and then I came in. Go ahead. Well, let's get a good microphone to come along in there. <laughs> with a girl and I can't remember the dialogue but I know that our interaction ended in such a way that she left upset with me. The next time I saw her was in a huge palace and she was immersed in a large pool of water. She asked me to take her hand as she lifted out both to me. Before I could decide which hand to take she completely started to show the whole of herself with many hands to choose from. And it was majestic and godly, the feeling I got from her. She was beautiful. But at the moment, the only question I had for myself was, which hand do I choose? There were so many hands. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I, um, I took it through like, like you did. I went with the different. Mm -hmm. uh, and Stages. the first one, I came up with... Uh, like a level line, and she said it was below, and wondering why it, uh, the first. yeah, the first paragraph, why, why it ended so abruptly. Hmm. But then all the other, she was in a high state, so that was the only low state that I saw. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you also saw a lot of beauty. She also said there was a lot of beauty in the dream. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The, and then the stages of beauty that she saw in the dream. Mm -hmm. And then I took it to um, her two questions where she, um, she said uh, she had this interaction with the same woman that she had at the end. Um, and she was left feeling like the lady was upset with her. And then she had a question at the end also like which hand to take mm -hmm. with the mm -hmm. same woman, mm -hmm. with the same woman. So I asked her, I asked her about that, and she said um, that, it, that she had a question before she went to bed about her mother, mm -hmm. and um, that she wanted the Dream Master to help her with this question with her mother. And, um, but I also asked her well, what, like, what was, was the state of mind that she had. Was there any content to that? Like, what question did she want to ask her mother? Well, it was a question. I said, if there was, I said, if there's anything I need to work on, or if there's anything in my life that I need, please help me mm -hmm. I before okay. I went to bed. Okay. And I had this dream. Good. So it wasn't specific to my mom, per se. It was just a question to myself. Good. Good. And then um, I asked her her state of mind, and she said uh, that she wasn't quite sure if the, if the woman was upset with her or not, she, she, it, that was something she perceived because she had turned around, stopped talking, just mm -hmm. immediately stopped talking, mm -hmm. turned around and walked off without explanation. Mm -hmm. And then it stopped abruptly. Mm 
mm -hmm. the, the conversation just ended mm -hmm. without her knowing like what had happened. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And um, and then I asked her if she could relate it to something. She said her mother. And um, then I said, well, what do you think about that? And she said, Marie said, uh, she can't, um, why can't she just accept me for who I am, her mother? And that's where we took it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And um, she said that the first part, she might have took it out of context because she mm -hmm. wasn't too yeah. sure yeah. Mm -hmm. if she was mad. Yes. She just left abruptly. Yes. But then when she met her the second time, mm -hmm. it was a relief and she was happy when to she see her. saw her again. Yeah. Good. Yeah. But I was left wondering why she had two questions that weren't answered and my brother took it to the beauty. Which was, yeah. it was very beautiful. Yeah. 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 Um, see, when you have a why question in a dream, mm -hmm. you can answer it after you get a state of mind. Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So at that moment, what state of mind was the dreamer in at that point? Mm -hmm. And I say? had asked her that, I think. Yeah, I... So. Of one, wondering, wondering, mm -hmm. of why... It's right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, wonder, why? Mm -hmm. Why were there so many hands to choose from? How could I choose out of so many? There were just so many. What is that teach you in the dream? Mm -hmm. Give me more questions. I had, I had like, yeah, so that's many true, questions. That's true. But what did it do to you at that moment? When yeah, you I were, felt confused. What, what? Confused. Confusion. More. What's that like? Come on. Um, well, I don't like that feeling of confusion. I don't like feeling confused. That's right. More, more, more. I, I like knowing that things are okay and things are organized. And yeah, you don't like that confusion. Right? I don't. Right, right. And I that's don't it. Like you confusion. were mm -hmm. bumped into right then at that moment. Right. Hmm. I, I had no where to go because I was asked to choose to, to take a hand. Okay. A hand. Right. So I felt like I had to choose a hand. A hand. Right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Like a... Literal. It was literal. A hand. Yeah. Not take my hands. Yes. And we have to know what the problem is now, don't we? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 See, it, it comes out of states of mind, the why. Remember that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, by the way, uh, why didn't you ask her which mm -hmm. hand to take? Good question. <laughs> you went into confusion. I did. That silence. Yeah. Right? It is. <laughs> Why didn't you ask her, hey, with so many hands you got, baby, which one do you want me to take? <laughs> right? <laughs> what? Yeah. yeah. Why didn't I? Uh, yeah. I should have just asked. What, was, what, what would it be like to do that in the dream for you? I guess instead of just being in awe and wonder, I should have just asked the question, which maybe what it doesn't does, take it back to my mom, because what, I do mm -hmm. ask her questions. Mm -hmm. uh, but we're talking about this kind of question. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, by the way, what would it mean to shake the hand of that woman? See, they, see, it, take a hand, right? It would have been great. What, what? It would have been great. Ah. Mm -hmm. And would block you 
There's a confusion. The confusion. Hmm. Mm. So we're getting the the why. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, yeah, it would have been great and uh, yeah. simple question too. Right. Which yeah, happened? Yeah. Yeah. Because. Uh, Take a. Mm-hmm. Say to Ahab, which one? Yeah. Right. And it would have been great. But this confusion did something. Yes. Mm-hmm. What did it do? Messed everything up. It, it kept me from experiencing something great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, do you mind talking about this state? I, I have an interest in that state. Go ahead, talk about it. Hmm. It's not a good place for me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Where does it hit you physically? Physically, it's bad. It's a bad place for me. Where? Um, my mental state. My mental state. Your mental? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It, yeah. It puts me in a bad place. Yeah, okay, see. I want to draw it. Like this one? Yeah, well. <laughs> no, no, okay. Come on, it goes further down? Come on. Yeah, it, well, it, um, no, come on. it does affect me mentally and physically, um, because then I don't function as well as a person. Okay. And then I don't have a good state of mind. Right, right. And it cuts I, out a good state of mind, yeah. yeah. Go ahead. And then I don't reach my higher state of mind like I should. Yeah. You know that it state of mind. It's yeah. had a played. It's played a long role in your life, hasn't it? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. It's happened many times. Yeah. What price are you paying for that state of mind that interrupts mm-hmm. and keeps you from? A high price. Experiencing something great. Yeah. 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 What would happen if you uh, identified uh, a whole bunch of them? Then we could ask some questions, but no. Mm-hmm. Like Barbara would ask, uh, uh, what is it about <laughs> these scenes that you've described in your past that is similar? To, mm-hmm. uh, what's common to it all? Right. Right. The Hesperian. And by the way, would you not agree it's likely to have come from something in the past? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, being uh, shut down right away. Yeah. It's when you were shut down. Mm-hmm. How old? Uh, really young. Hmm? Really young. Yeah, just a four or five year old. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I recall. Definitely about probably about four. About four, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Being shut down, being told to shut up and Yeah. Mm. Uh, Always told uh, do as I say, not as I do. Uh, you care to talk about it? That's fine. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. What happened? Um well that was the big thing. Do uh do as I say, not as you know, not as I do. Oh, and a big one was always, um, what was it? Uh, let it be, let, let it be, let it be, be, let it be said, let it be done. Uh-huh. Do it again. Let it be said, let it be done. Yeah. What was the scene? Um, <laughs> there you were. To always uh, just do what I'm told, always do what I'm told, folding laundry, doing things around the house, uh, being home on, all the time, on time. I, I mean... So you, there's something about this that occurred early that's important when you were four years old. Yeah. If you can recall it, it would be very helpful to get out of it. Yeah. It's up to you whether you want to um, explore it. Well, 
Yeah. Um. Well, getting hit with the belt. Getting hit with the belt with the belt buckle on. What happened? Uh, he hit me with the belt. With, forgot to take the belt buckle off. Hit me in the head with it. And That's good. I like that, except for one thing. Can you tell me what happened before that brought it on? Um, not listening. What? Just not listening. Do it again? I didn't listen to him. I'm sure of that, but what were you doing? So um, acting up. I tell him no. I told him no. See, it's very important to know what it was like for him to see you acting up. That's his language, acting up. Mm -hmm. What would be your language for what you were doing at that time? Oh, um, I want to say it was because I wanted to uh, have my friend stay over for dinner and he said no. And I think I asked why. And it that you don't question why. So see, he used that scene to teach this lesson. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. But um you think it was about the dinner. Well, I mean... Um, you know, asking about, can you have a friend over for dinner? Mm -hmm. well, uh, what do you think it was about? What that got him upset? Um, well, I'm sure probably questioning his authority. No, that's true. But no. What state uh, of mind do you think you were in when you were challenging him? Um... I was happy to have a friend there. You were happy? Mm hmm Right? You were happy? Open? Mm hmm Right? Yeah. I wanted to play more. Wanted to play more? Yeah. Right? Yeah. See this state? Mm hmm He didn't like you being in that state, did he? No, I was only allowed to have one friend. Right? My whole life I only had one friend. Mm -hmm. That's right. See, we want to keep people from being in that state. Because mm -hmm. we, if we let them be in that state, what the heck are they going to do? Yeah, yeah. They'll be gone, <laughs> that we won't be able to control them. Yeah. So he seized on this great moment. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pow! Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Mm. By the way, whose confusion was it? Yours or his? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. And you picked it up. Yeah, yeah. Because you seem to be so right, powerful. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. What does that do to all of these other sins? Yeah. Finish it. I gotta let those... Each one you were about ready to come out. Yeah. Right? I gotta let those happen. The good states. Yeah, yeah. Come out. Yeah. And then, yeah. Right? This is the... This is the... Uh, mm. Whose problem was it then? His. Yes. His. Yeah, <laughs> big time. Yeah. Yeah, big time. Yeah. 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 Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you much. Yeah. Thank you very, very much. <laughs> Good show.
times in the morning. <laughs> we ready, camera? So my dad is going, uh, my dad is giving out gifts. Maybe my mom is in the room too, but I don't see her. I feel like she is. My sisters and I are there, especially my older, younger sister. And my dad bends over and whispers to her with a beatific face. He has a real, a face like I almost never see on him. Really happy and smiling or kind. And he holds his hand up to his face and he says to my sister, I want to go play with the boys. And at first it seems weird to me. I don't really understand it. But then I realize that what he's doing is he's going to come over to me and give me uh, my gift first. And he's telling her that. And so he does. He gives me a gift. And well, this part of the dream I don't remember most of the details, but I think he gives me more than one gift, uh, and to each of us, more than one. But anyway, at least one of these gifts he gives to me, and I, it's really, well, the gift is nondescript in the dream. Mm -hmm. I don't really have a good image of it, but it's, it's a really a good one, and I just remember it being mm -hmm. really good. Um, and this wasn't in the dream, but something at, while I'm transcribing at transcription time, wanted me to remember about Logos right at that point. So, anyway, back in the dream, the gift is wrapped in, maybe it's wrapped in aluminum foil, like a large burrito or something. Or no, it's in, it's in a different package, a box, maybe. And uh, there's a couple of them. But I just remember feeling really special and happy. Um, there's more to the dream, but I just can't remember it. My dad giving out gifts? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Someone else? Well, I'm kind of interested in the scene two, where he's, um, or one I'm calling scene two, where his dad is leaning over with this beatific look on his face and saying to the girl, I'm going to go play with the boys. It seems kind of odd, kind of like a bait and switch. Mm -hmm. I want to know about that scene. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, me too, actually. <clears throat> now, how can you... Put that into a question? Or something? Yeah, how can you use that to open up the dream? You got to so you have a good point. Like... Um, <clears throat> This is very difficult stuff to do, but the questions are always difficult. Um, <laughs> so, um, so um, what was it like when your father was whispering that to your sister? Well, I, I do say in the dream that at first it seemed weird to me. I didn't. I did not really understand it. But I can tell you a couple of judgments I made. I think I made about it. But and, that would in the, the dream, dream. But that would be after no. the initial. So which one are you asking? As Judgments are okay? As long as it took place in the dream. Yeah. I think I had a mixture of happiness that he's coming over to me, but also a sense of empathy for the injustice to my mm -hmm. sister. Mm -hmm. Because where was the injustice?
Um, right. That is a good question. Um, because I, I, I guess I had a sense that there's more to the message than what's being said. And? And that is that he likes me more, or I'm more important, or um, she's being left behind, or you know, there's, there's no reason for it. No. Uh, and he was standing with her at the time. He could, have, he could have started with her. So what's the point? What's he trying to do? Uh, it did have a sense of injustice, but I can't nail it down more than that. That's true. Yeah. 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 By the way, um, <clears throat> What is he doing as a, uh, next? What is he doing to, to, from this point on? He's doling out gifts, is he not? Yes. Yeah. 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 What do you think of that as a maneuver? What happened to your sense of interests? Gone. Well, what did it? I'm overwhelmed with the rare attention he's giving me, if there's, any, if there's any attention at all, but then the doubly rare way, the state that he's in at that time. So, I mean, geez, it might as well have been a Mexican burrito in my house. It would have been fantastic. Right, <laughs> right, right, right. Uh, what did that do to your sense of injustice? Um, well, you did ask me already, and I, I, I said it's it's... It's gone. It's absolutely gone. I'm focusing more now on how happy I am for having his attention and having received something. And gave up your question. I, it gives up my question. That's yeah, right. Yeah. That's <clears throat> right. Yeah, when I could have said something to him like, hey, what are you doing, Jack? Is she chopped liver or something or what? Yeah. Or what are you trying to prove? Yeah, yeah. Uh, by the way, uh, does he seem to know what he's doing? Yes, this is a transmission scene. Clearly. He's in control. He's the, he's, it might as well have been a, a transfiguration. <laughs> a trans, what's the word in there? Right? It might as well have been. It's so what, did, what was the role of handing out the gifts? What did it do to this drama? It makes him look like just and right and giving and in control. What does that say? In control? I, I can't. Oh. Hello. Hey, Hello. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, right. He's angelic. It makes him look angelic, yeah. Um, um, uh, rather clever, isn't it? Yeah. I spend a lot of my own time doing this shit to people. In fact, I had just the day before. <laughs> what does that mean? Come on. <laughs> if you've been doing I want to know if that's what I'm doing, giving out gifts, then what the hell is my, what am I teaching? Yeah, and what are you saying? <clears throat> chumana chumana. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> That's a good way to silence someone that's so clever. Oh, yes. That is the effect. Isn't it? Yeah. Can't argue with it. Yeah. First rule of politics, right? Yeah. He, he who pays... Uh, who, who Hand out gifts while you have secret... Uh, agendas or whatever. Uh, agendas with someone who happens to be within the family. That's not divide and conquer, is it? Man. Can play it out on a national scale or a family scale. <laughs> it doesn't matter. <laughs> Either way. Well, it really does. I mean, it leads me to. So you've pushed it a little further in the sense that the way that it functions is to shut the other person up. Then it makes me want to know what is it that the other person would have said that I did not want them to say, or don't, or I'm preventing from them from even opening up or talking about by. Hey, here's another. Yeah. You only need one 
question. What's going on? What's <laughs> exactly? Yeah. But the positive side is that you are seeing him in the highest state you've ever seen him. Yeah. While he's playing this game. Awful. Yep. Yeah. It's pretty extreme. Yeah. And it's uh, deviously subtle. Yeah. 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 It reminds me of what... Go ahead, go ahead. No, it reminds me of what you often say about pathologo scenes where they know that they're doing it. Yeah. I, I, and in all the scenes with my sisters and myself, I had the feeling that my... In waking life, I had the feeling that my father, he knew what he was doing. Yeah. But it's like a sense of... Um, we're, we're like, he's a zombie and we're zombies. It's like we're, you're walking around doing it anyway and mm -hmm. you don't know why. That's right. They know that, but they don't know why. Because if you did know why... You wouldn't do it. Yeah. Good, yeah. Good show. <laughs> All right. Thank you, sir. First, just make one announcement. Please. G Gina isn't here tonight, and I did send out an email that she's offered her house for tomorrow. Um, but you two guys, if you want to know, I think she'd like you to call her, so I'll give you her phone number, okay? Yes. It's like 10 to 12, in Costa Mesa. I would just go to the end and look at the part that I left out. <laughs> okay. Do you want to, wait a minute. Anyone want to ask a question or propose one to our dreamer? Now, you don't often find seon thinking right there. Look. <laughs> He's pondering. I wonder where I should sit. But no, excuse me, because I didn't read. Well, I didn't I would ask, uh, what would you say to mine that you were teaching at US, UCI and not being able to see the students that you're teaching? <laughs> That's very fine with me. <laughs> yeah, that's the part of, that's why I say let's just skip to the very end because um, uh, yeah, they can't see me and I can't see them so um, I can't, they can't see me and I can't see them because of this big equipment island so it's a kind of a weird, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. creepy so, thing. The same question I asked the other few minutes ago, okay? What's the general theme? What happened to that theme? Hmm. It appears in several places. Hmm. When did it shift? What do you make of it? I guess I feel safe is, in, is how I answer it. I feel safe when I'm hidden from the students. Yeah, I feel safe. Yeah. When? When they can't see me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, someone else? Um. Mm -hmm. I 
In the second paragraph, does a question come up for the dreamer? Yes. Thank you. Question? What is this? Who are you? That's right. What is this? Who are you? Right? Yeah. Right? What is it again? What is this? Go ahead. Who are you? This guy who comes in. Does that repeat itself? Yeah. Oh, gee, uh, what yeah. happens to these great questions? Well, they don't get asked. Well, they... Um, you don't do what with them? I don't deal with them. What? I don't deal with them. They're your questions. And you're not dealing with them. Right. Oh. When do you deal with them in the dream? Well, I mean, I'm wondering about that creature, and the That's right. the bird opens it up, unfolds it, good, and then I see that it's something. So therefore, you can Wait. explore and answer that question when it comes out to be what's the subject. But I don't ask. But I do when it is what? When it... A rabbit. <laughs> when it, when right? it can't talk. Come on, right? Yeah. But you, you don't right. do it when it deals with what kinds of things? People who can ah, talk. Ah, people. People. Who, and how are they functioning? The people? Yeah. What name would you give them? What they're doing? Are they adding something to what you're doing? Or is it a... Come on. Well, no, they're not adding anything to it. Is it detrimental? Or takes away? Yeah. Ah. And you will finish it. You allow it? You yeah. don't say anything? Uh-uh. Ah, but you do when it's a rabbit. Right. Hmm. Well, yeah, because I've got that, that student next to me, and so I say it aloud because he can hear it too. Yeah, yeah, look here. When it's a rabbit, I can speak out loud. Join with another student. Mm -hmm. What's the dream telling you? Oh. Mm. So, look here. Mm. State of mind, okay? What was it like when you had this question, the first one? Well, when, I, when the guys came in with the photocopied stuff. And you, what is this? Yeah. Who are you? What, what, what state of mind? I was... Um, in the dream. Irritated. Well, I don't know the word. Say um, more. I was a little angry. Ah. And, um... And? How much? A little bit? Tiny bit? Upset? Got angry. Yeah. Guys coming up doing something like this? Yeah. Yeah. But they, but I didn't, they didn't stay in my mind, so... Uh, but yeah, I was, I was, I was a little angry. Mm -hmm. hmm. What do you do when you get angry? Become quiet. Yeah, you don't say anything about what got you angry. Hmm. What's this costing you? 
in this dream? What's his question? Well, I, I mean, I don't know. The, um, the next teacher said she knew these guys, so she would talk to them. But not you. You're no. not the anger. Um, yeah. And then you end up climbing under the stuff, which is what most instructors do. Well, I was, the screen went black, so I was trying to figure out what happened. Yeah, well, that's what most instructors do. They become electricians and... Well, I mean, you got... Oh, yeah, that's true. You know, it's usually a wire. Oh. And so you got to find out where it goes or what happened. So I always try to do the wire thing when my screen goes black. What does that do to your primary goal? Well, yeah, oh, I, I mean... I know, they, they hired you to teach them electricity. No. Oh. I mean, I would have, if it didn't work, I would have done the class without the computer. Yeah. But then I discovered the class was over. It was time to go anyway. Yeah. But did you use, did you empty your anger? Did you direct your anger? Well, I didn't hang on to it. I mean, they... they of course. I was irritated when they yeah. came in, and then the other guy yeah, comes yeah. in, and happened, then a third guy, I think. Wait a minute, it happened twice, too, didn't it? Yeah, or, or maybe even three times. Yeah, three times, right. And they're just sitting back there, so... Yeah, yeah. I just forgot about them when they came in. As long as they, since they were quiet, although they were talking, but... So what are you doing with your question? But it's kind of my condition of being shut down. Yeah. See, that's are, the thing. Are you familiar with that? Yeah. What does it mean? Talk about that state. Shut down. Go ahead. Well, it's a good question. Um, And that, that's that paragraph at the end. Yeah, that's a good one. You know, it's like, um, I mean, I know I can just go do the next lecture on my eye without even preparing because it's, I'm kind of on automatic pilot. You know, I've just done it so much that I just pretty, it just, just comes out just automatically. Yeah. And I can kind of like stay shut down and just do it. But, um, and I, it, I don't need to see the students. <laughs> That's weird, but... Um, yeah. Gee. Um, how does that... See, what is it yeah. like for you being in the dream, a lecture where you're not... You don't see the students? Right. What's it, what's it like teaching in that atmosphere? Well, it's like the student comes up to me and says, I like your class. And I have no comment, right? I can't respond to the students. Yeah. yeah be, and now we have to ask, what are you doing that permits that or allows it to take place? I'm in a state of being shut down. Yeah. You were after this state of mind. What's it like when you feel this shut down? That's your language, so I'm using it. Well, you know, it's so calm. It's so much a part of my life. Oh, what's it costing you? Well, I'm not getting my goals accomplished. No, no, that's right. Therefore, that state is rather important, isn't it? Yeah. No, yeah, it's cutting through your own goals. Yeah, um, mm -hmm. What's it like? Could you put more words on it? It's safe. Safe. It's, it's safe. I'm, nobody's going to see me. Nobody's going to um, 
I'm not, nobody's going to bother me. I'm not going to, um, um, what's the word? I'm not going to um, offend anybody. Yeah. And, um, but I, I don't get my goals done. Yeah, right, if you sacrifice, sacrifice your goals for that, yeah. Yeah, so it's like a yeah. state I have to stay in. Yeah, yeah, that's, that goes back all the way, doesn't it? Yeah. Huh? Yeah, it possibly you happen to have an early scene of it or? Of being shut down? Yeah, yeah mm. especially with... Well, I mean, there's that scene with the three-year-old or something where I come in up from the outside and I'm really excited to tell my mother something and she's not looking at me and my aunt says, go sit down on the couch and stay quiet or we'll throw you out to the bears. It's kind of like that. But there's a feeling like... Um, it's a feeling of like I'm going to really be, if I really come out that I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to offend somebody. You're going to be sent, you're going to be kicked out to the bears. Yeah, it, yeah, it's, it's yeah. like I'm going to really yeah. Yeah, be in the middle of a... Yeah, what was the crime you committed? I was just open and spontaneous yeah, and yeah. passionate that, and... That, uh, enough to get your mother to uh, dump all of this on you, is that right? Well, she didn't even look at me. She got my aunt to do it. That's even worse. Yeah. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Why do you think she's afraid of that state? It's a rather nice state, isn't it? Being excited, open. Well, she's... She herself is totally shut down, and she had, she had a lot to express, but couldn't after she got married or something. Yeah, so you're imitating her? Yeah, uh, yeah, right. Being like her. Like her. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think it's time to dump it. I mean, because she's afraid of being open and... And interacting with people. Yeah, groups. and being excited and open and happy that she dumps all the... I mean, go, feed you to the bears, go sit there, be quiet. So this is being quiet. And no one can see you, you're safe, no bother. That's what... This is her... <laughs> is this the state she wants you to be in? Uh, by the way, when you're in that state, can she then get you to do what she wants you to do? Oh, yeah. Oh, then this is a... And I'll do it, too. Oh, that's where you get that stuff in the dream of being an electrician. Yeah. yeah. Right. <laughs> that's good, isn't it? Uh-huh. <laughs> but it's your job to fix things up, to hell with your higher goal. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, it's nice, though, that in the dream, you see, you can come out, but it's a modest right. coming out. So you really need to do it with these things called, what are they called? Uh, people? Yeah, yeah, people. yeah. <laughs> Say, ideally, what should you have told your mother at that moment? Hey, if you're not quiet, I'm going to throw you out to the bears. That's what I'll do. Go ahead. What are you going to tell me? I'm your mother. Well, that was the aunt that said that. I probably would have looked at my mother and said, can you speak? Yeah, because that's your aunt doing all the speak, doing yeah. all the dirty work. Yeah. So what do you want to tell your mother? And my mother's just shut down and being, like, depressed or something. So what do you want to tell her, then? Um... 
that um, okay I'll talk to you later after you're done I'll talk to you I'm still here what are you going to tell her she's there she's depressed you know, she's I in this state I don't know what it is I wanted to tell her I, I had been outside and discovered something fun or beautiful or no. and I came running in and wanted no, to what share are you going to tell her her by the way, you're a kid, three years old. That yeah. seems real. Yeah. We're going to kill you. We're going to throw you to the bears if you yeah. don't cut up. Right? Yeah. Right. I thought it was real. And you happen to have a mother. And she's seeing someone threatening to kill you. What are you going to tell your mother? That aunt, auntie is not very nice. Better watch out for her. Not very nice. She's, a, she's going to be a killer. Yeah, she's going to be a killer. Well, you better do it again. What are you going to tell her? Auntie wants to kill me. She might kill you too. Better watch out. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> right? But you're going to have to get out of what? Wake the hell up? See, she, that ant was shut down too. Oh. It's in the whole family. Yeah, it's it's um local local religion. Yeah, especially the women. Finish it. The women were shut down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What would it be like to say to tell that to her? What do you think it would do? What do you think it would do to you, for you? Well, um, I don't know. Um, you know, I tr there were a couple of times when I was interested in coming out and doing some stuff and I, I tried to borrow money from my aunt and she um, basically said it was too much money. So I had to like plead with her because I wanted to get this book and she was paying for my college at the time and so it was like this whole scene. I had to convince her. I don't even know if she ended up giving me the money. I think I bought the book myself. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. it was like she wouldn't support my coming out beyond just basic survival. Yeah, she's afraid. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, did I get an answer to the question? I think I asked you, what would it do to you if you could have said those very things at the time? I don't know. I might have gotten thrown out faster. <laughs> it would have risked their life. Yeah. But you'd be free. Yeah. Sure, I'm glad we'd all say goodbye at your funeral, that you'd be free. Well, yeah, I think that's, I think that's the earliest scene I can remember of. Yeah. Yeah, pretty powerful. Shut down. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Isn't it nice to know that it boils down to being able to confront people and and demand to know what they're doing? Who are you? Yeah, what are you doing? Right. Are there people that you'd like to ask that to and are yeah. not? Yeah. A couple. Yeah. Mm. Is it time to do it? You want to test this? Uh-oh, everybody clear out. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. Well, we'll have fun seeing you after. Wait a minute, they might throw you to the bears. Well, yeah, so that's the thing. That's I a risk. I, I feel... I feel like I'm going to offend them if I ask what they're doing. 
the question is whether or not there's a need for you to ask it, whether it offends yeah. them. That's their problem, not yours. Well, they're students. No, it's their problem if they get upset, not yours. You're asking a genuine, real question. Who right. are you? Look, who are you? They get upset. What is this? What are you doing? I feel like I have to have the answer in my back pocket. No. So that if they can't no. answer it, I have to say, okay, here's the answer. No, no. 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 That's weird. No. That's the very nature of a question. Yeah. I don't, don't want to leave them with the question. You don't? Yeah, you don't have the answer, so you're asking them, hey, what's going on? And you need to ask a couple of people that, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. When are you going to do it? We'll find out. You'll let us know. Yeah, Tuesday. Ah, good. Tuesday. 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 Question day. <laughs> Thank you. Well, were you getting off easy tonight? Say, um, <clears throat> I, think we, I think I'll announce a dialogue to get into that I think might be important for our work. Right? And uh, there are two of them. I'll give you the titles on the email. Okay? I want to make sure because there could be two others, so... All I have to do is check it. Yeah, they're minor. They're sometimes called minor dialogues, but they're central hmm. because it's going to show the nature of testing. Are they Platonic dialogues? Pardon me. Plato's, Plato's dialogues. Yes. Yes. It's either going to be the Lysias or I'll, I'll, I'll pass them out. Well, let's have a cup of coffee and time for talk. Mm -hmm. Good heavens. Here we are doing nothing. Right? Looks like there ought to be a good place right here. Right here. I brought that book. Oh. 